The SMS Web Form List Builder is a very powerful feature of the platform. In this particular example, I'm going to show you a form that I've already built, but if you want to add a new one, then simply click on the plus sign here and then fill in the details. Let me take you through the campaign that I've already built. First of all, you need to specify the website where the form is going to go. Next, you need to indicate which campaign it's going to be. Here I've got the different campaigns that I've got on the system listed. So I've chosen Demo Contest. Then choose suitable labels for each of name, phone number and optionally email. You can also set a background image both to the form itself and the button. Next you need to specify the width of the field and the field height. Let me just show you an example here. Here I've set the width of the field as 15 pixels and 90 pixels long. That's long enough to put in some information. And then choose a suitable colour for the label. In this particular case I've chosen a dark grey colour and I do that by pressing on this icon to select that particular colour there. The colour label corresponds to the colour of the words used to identify each label. And then finally you want to specify a frame height and width which will fit in the area occupied on the website. Additionally you can choose a background colour. If you've added a label for email then you can integrate the email that's sent with common autoresponders here and you'll need to put in the relevant information in this space below here. Click save once you've finished. Final step is to get your code. Clicking on this icon here enables you to select the code, simply highlight it all and right click and copy and then you can paste it into your website. Here I've got a sample website with a form on the side. Putting in my details here shows you how the form works. When the subscribe button is clicked, the information will be passed into the text messaging platform. New subscribers to the system can be viewed in the My Subscriber list. That will be covered in a future video.